Francois. Fra ah, Francois, no. Oh my god, no, 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 no. Hello everyone, welcome back. Today we're playing Amnesia the Bunker. We're gonna start a playthrough of this game. And I won't talk too much in this intro. The only thing I will say is if you enjoy this video, please leave a like and comment and share with every single one of your friends that have ever existed. That would make me a very happy YouTuber. So let's go new game. Uh, yes, we're going to do normal because I'm too much of a baby for hard right now. I played the demo, and this is a very, very scary game. <laughs> okay. And yes, I have played the demo. It's about an hour long. And I haven't played any Amnesia games. I haven't played any Amnesia games. Um, so this is the first Amnesia game that I'll be playing. I usually... I, I really like the Penumbra games that Frictional Games have made. I've played all of those. To survive this war, you'll need two things. First, a basic set of skills. Second, the good god dang sense to do whatever's necessary. I can teach you the first. The second is up to you. This is World War One, The Great War. Oh! The bunker. I hear somebody. Oh, looks like we got a waxing gibbous moon. That's a lovely moon. That's one of my favorite gibbous moons. I could pick... Yes, we should probably keep this helmet. I don't know if I have one on, but I'm taking this. Don't want to get hit in the head with some random shrapnel. Oh. I'm already wearing one. If you could see by the shadow. I look like the TF2 engineer. <laughs> Is that a body up there? I think so. Let's just make our way through the bunker. This takes place in like 1917 or something like that. I'm I'm not sure. World War 1, whenever World War 1 was. Now, this is something that was not in the demo, so this is all new to me. Hold down R to check how many bullets you have. But I need a gun. There we go. Hold down. I don't want to shoot just yet. I hear machine gun fire over there. Ah, oh, yes. A strategically placed brick. I know what this is for. Let's try that again. Aha! That's what they taught me in basic training, how to throw bricks at the enemy. Oh! Friendlies! Wait for me! I'm coming. I will meet you in no man's land. More revolver bullets. Are we gonna actually fight? Oh, 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 ah, yes we are! Yes we are! I don't have any bullets loaded. <laughs> How do I load bullets in this thing? Okay, okay. Gotta do it one by one. <laughs> While they're shooting at me. Is that the... Is that Germany? Wait, I didn't get to get any of them. Oh, thank you. He's gonna get shot. I already know he's gonna... Oh, he survived. This is so cool. I mean, no, it's not cool. World War I was a very horrible war that should have never been fought, but... <laughs> you have been injured. Hold tab to see how bad it is. Got some blood on the fingers. That's okay. I'll survive. I just... It, is that my health bar? Is that supposed to be my health bar right there? Like how many fingers are bloody? Huh. Oh! 
We're getting hit by a shrapnel. We just picked up an item that can be used for crafting. Oh yeah, crafting is not something that I did in the demo. I'm not sure. Come on, man. Craft yourself a band-aid. I don't know how. Is there, like, alcohol somewhere that I could... Okay, well, you're just gonna have to deal with your bloody fingers. Ah, I see sh something shiny. What's this? Grenades! I forget all the controls, really. Okay, R is to take out your gun. Tab is to look at your bloody hand. Uh, it seems to me this door is locked. How do I switch grenades? Uh, or how do I... Ah, tab. You just gotta click tab. And then... Take a grenade. Toss that bad boy. Boom! I think I'll keep this grenade out, just in case. Just in case any Germans want to get the jump on me. Okay, I'll take that. I feel like all the stuff I'm going to gather in this is just going to be immediately, like, disappeared when I get into the bunker. I don't know. We'll see if we, we keep our stuff. So I'll try to preserve my ammo. Ah, the adventures of the TF2 engineer. Hey, that was German. That was German, right? I heard German. Why, are, why is Germany all... Huh? <gasps> grenade! Grenade! Oh, these are... These are gas grenades. They're trying to gas me out. Oh my gosh. No, 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 no. I didn't have a gas mask. Oh! Thank you. My angel. I did not expect... I did not expect all of this. In the demo, it just kind of puts you right into the bunker, so... That role, my friend. I hear other voices. Huh? Oh, a I'm on patrol tonight, then. Said I, will. I don't I don't really know what they're saying. I guess that mustard gas really messed with my sense of hearing. Back on the battlefield. Oh gosh. Hey, where are my buddies? They were just talking. Alone again. In no man's land. Eventually I will end up like that guy. Hopefully not. Whoa. Hmm. Was that even me? Was I'm not sure what's happening, everybody. <laughs> I, guess, I guess that's what amnesia is. <laughs> Drink. This is straight vodka. You'll forget about all the pain once you drink this. Feel better? No, he just passed out? Okay. Now he's throwing up. I think. <laughs> Is that throw up noises? I'm not sure. It's okay, I gotcha. I gotcha. Oh, so I rappelled down there just to save a dude. Okay, let's get you back to the bunker, man. This western front looks 
very... No, 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 no! Ah, ah. No, no. Very deadly, I was gonna say very deadly. They're shooting him! Ah! <laughs> oh, he's still drunk. Oh no. And I blacked out again. Oh my gosh. Ah, it sucks having amnesia. You are now on your own. Learn, adapt, experiment, and survive. Hmm. Yeah, this, this, this game is going to be very, uh, what's the word? I don't even know what the word is. I forgot it. Badoom, tsh, amnesia, get it? Okay, sorry about that. This game is, so everything in this game is like randomized. Items will be in different places on different playthroughs. Is my finger fixed? Um, yeah, so this is where the demo starts, and so I completely forgot. Where do we get stuff? So I think all the notes and stuff are the same, in the same spots, but like med kits and grenades and ammo, those will all be randomly generated. So each playthrough is a little different. Let's get this chair out of the way. And... Okay. It is July 10th, 1916. Uh... Soldat Clement... <laughs> I don't know if I'm pronouncing that right. Admitted to medical treatment following events of 9th of July. Personal effects held in the storage locker. Patient remains in weak coma state. Will respond to stimuli. Oh, they're talking about me. I think. But only for brief periods of time. When last roused, ooh, he reported no memory of recent events. Had trouble recalling even his own name, most likely due to severity of initial head trauma. Will continue to monitor. If status does not improve in a week's time, recommend transfer to Saint Saint Etienne for neurological tests. Signed, Doctor Josinski. Thanks, Doctor Josinski. My favorite doctor. So I forgot my name? I guess I could craft a new name, can't I? Huh, I'll have to think about that. What should my new name be? Am I even French? I don't think so. What if I'm American or British? How can I trust? How can I trust that I'm French? This is a French bunker. Okay, here we go. So, this is our flashlight. Um, we have to charge it in order to use it. Gotta crank that bad boy. And... It's the loudest flashlight I've ever used, that's for sure. But we have to use it. We have to charge it, because... I mean, it runs out, and then we have to charge it, and then the noise makes the monster angry because there's a monster that's going to be stalking us in case you didn't know. You'll hear it soon enough, don't worry. Uh, Dr. Jasinski again. I'll try my best to do a French accent so we get the real immersion. Ready? I've been practicing for a whole hour before I recorded this. <laughs> Body. Okay, no, that's not a friend. Of Saint Sergeant Sergeant Reynard, multiple lacerations, chest cavity torn to shreds, every rib cracked, skull cracked, open by repeated blunt force trauma. Who could have done this to him? The monster. The monster did this to me. Cracked my brain right open. All photos that you pick up can be found. Oh yeah, here we go. Gosh, is that me? Is that a picture of me? I don't know who that is. What are they experimenting? That is horrific. Dr. Jasinski, what are you doing, man? Okay. As you can see, this game is very dark. Light is our friend. 
Monster does not like light. Uh, that was fuel. Wow, they burnt all the bodies. I think there's a note explaining why all the bodies are burnt. Somewhere. Ah, uh, lock. Open. We haven't heard the monster yet, which is good. The monster will come out of these holes, though. As you can see, they are scattered around this here bunker. <laughs> I heard a voice. Oh, yeah, that's right. There's a dude that's alive right here. Hello! Are you Dr. Josinski? Mm-hmm. You gotta speak up, buddy. I can't really hear you. You want to escape? Yes. You need to blow it back open. There's dynamite in the arsenal. Ah, arsenal. And a handle to trigger it somewhere in the excavation site. Okay. Get them, and you can make it out. Oh, shit. That thing, it's coming for me. Ah, there's Here, the monster. Take this. Finish me off. Ah, thank you. I want to die at the hands of a border soldier. Not that monster. But then I would be discharged for friendly fire. I don't want to do that. What if I just knock you out so you don't see the monster coming? All right. All right, I'll shoot you in the face. Get it. Do the job, please. The pantry? Why are there bullets in the pantry? Tell me. I kind of like, <laughs> if you have a gun out and crank your flashlight, you use kind of like your ring finger to do it. That's a, that's a cool detail. Alright, we got the bullets. We got... Do I reload this weapon? Ah, yes. Very slowly. One, a two. One for me, one for you. How's it gonna go? I knew that was going to happen. I'm wondering how different this is this is going to be from the demo. I'm not sure. But whenever I see these holes, I like to just shove a chair into them. <laughs> it's either going to piss the monster off. Yep, it pissed the monster off. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't shove... Maybe he wants food. Here. There. Enjoy. What's a good French meal? Um... I really don't know. A baguette? Okay. The door is locked. Cannot open this one. But... I can open... Did I go in here? Yes, I did. I can open this one over here. Gotta shoot this off. Yeah, that's gonna make the monster angry. Okay. I hear him... I hear him somewhere. We don't want to make too much noise. And this is like a save room. Like if you ever played Resident Evil, they got little save rooms with like uh, storage things. Yeah, use this box for storing things from your inventory. Because we do have an inventory limit. And we could save the game by turning on this little lamp. I'd like to believe that in this little area is a safe place from the monster. I'm not sure though. I don't know. So far he has never been in here. And what am I wearing? I woke up in like pajamas. <laughs> I just I just realized that. I have this can't be a uniform. This looks like pajamas. 
Bat Bat Batiste Batiste. Aw oh, man. So there's dog tags around this place, and usually there will be a code on the back of them because it, uh, the code unlocks a locker. That one did not have a code, unfortunately. Notes from head clerk re dog tags. Important! When processing deceased soldiers, please check the reverse side for their ID tags. Yeah, see, that's... Because you could open lockers and get some good stuff. Let me just read all these notes. Update to all medical and mortuary personnel. The rat problem has not gotten any better. They're swarming every dead body. They're even coming after the wounded. But the vermin have no interest in flesh after it is burnt. That's why all the bodies were burnt. Okay. So a new policy must be instituted. The bodies of all deceased soldiers must be burned. I have spoken to Father Durai about this matter. He will provide proper... Consecration? That's a new word. I'll write that down later. For the deceased. Remains will be preserved for families. This is not ideal and it fills my soul with pain, but burning the dead seems to be the only way to stop the rats from coming. So burn them we must. I feel like in World War I, rats were probably the least of your worries. But I, I don't know. Maybe, I mean, rats, they could carry diseases, yeah. But... Oh, nothing in here. Man, I'm getting so unlucky. Come on, give me something good. The newspaper? Is the war over? No? War is still going on? Okay, we will continue to fight. Oh yeah, down here is the generator. Um... Yeah, this will- this note will probably tell us. Excuse me. Warning, generator fuel is extremely flammable. Do not light any fires near the fuel. Do not fire any weapons near the fuel. For God's sake, do not even smoke your cigarettes near it. Store it only in sturdy metal canisters. Glass breaks far too easily. If it spills, wipe the area clean immediately, immediately, then dispose of the rags outside of the bunker. Um. Okay, so, in this room, no lighting up any cigars or anything like that. But we can fuel this up. Please! Who are you? Frillo. Frillo? Frillo. 3227. I will make sure to open your locker. Hopefully you gave me something good. So, fuel. Yes, yes, yes. I know, I know. Let's take the fuel out. Put it in here. The generator powers all of the lights. The thing is, we gotta be... We gotta use it sparingly because... I mean... Yeah, this is a survival horror game. Um, the pocket watch, not really useful. I never used it, but it just tells you how much time is left on the generator. Uh, okay, let's just turn it on, just so you guys can see kind of what it does. I won't leave it on because I need it. I, I want to conserve this. <laughs> At least up until the point where I got to in the demo. So far, it seems the monster is a lot less aggro compared to the demo. Oh, dang. What was the... What was the code? 3227? 3227. 3... 2... 2... How do you say this in French? Tre... Do, do, I don't know. I don't know French. I took Spanish in high school, not French. Alright, so. You can overcome most obstacles in multiple ways. Use your wits and your brains. Unfortunately, I don't have any. Experiment. If you think something might be possible to do, it probably is. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I might as well turn that off. 
I don't know if it helps with the fuel consumption, turning off the lights, but maybe. Have not seen another human for hours. Uh, I might be the last. But in the hope that there is, there might be another, I leave this now so you do not waste any time. This is the only exit, the only way out of this hell of our own making. It was blown closed, it needs to be blown open. Don't bother digging impossible. Blow it up. The dynamite is locked in the arsenal. The detonator handle is somewhere down in the Roman tunnels, deeper in hell. I go now to try to retrieve them both, though I do not know if you exist. I pray for you. Please extend me the same courtesy. I don't know who that is. Who is that? Does that have a name on it? I don't know. Roman, they mentioned Roman tunnels, so I guess while they were digging, <laughs> while they were digging this bunker, they kind of breached some Roman, Roman ruins or something like that. And I'm guessing release the monster. And this is the exit. This is the thing that we need to blow up. That's kind of the goal of the game. Oh, I completely forgot. Let me, let me run back here. This is the map. This is the map. And we could zoom in. So we're in the blue area. Uh, yeah. Right here, exit. These other areas we have to open. And then I think this is the entire game. I'm pretty sure. Um, yeah. I mentioned how I played the Penumbra games. Oh. Let's turn that back on. Uh, I played the Penumbra games. And after playing this demo, I got like some heavy Penumbra vibes. So, I think that's why I'm playing this game now. Because it kind of reminds me of the... Oh, let me turn off. Let me turn off the generator. I want to conserve the fuel. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's okay. Monster's not going crazy right now, so we, we got some time. I chose normal, right? This is... This is normal. So... Ah, uh, yes. Now the door is open. Do I want it to be open? That's just another way for the monster to attack me. Um, ah uh, yes. See, I, I, I kind of know where to go after playing the demo. I guess that's kind of unfair. I just really wanted to play this game. Because it's been, it was delayed, like, I think two times. Oh no. Do you hear that? Do you hear that? Noise is dangerous. Consider being careful how much of it you make. So maybe I shouldn't drop this helmet on the ground? Oh, that didn't really make a loud noise. These are the lockers that I was talking about. Um... Ooh. Another picture. Uh, it seems they're using a tool to open the vent. I think, yeah, I think we could find that tool. I'm not entirely sure. Hmm. Some propaganda. Ooh, dog tag. G. Travers. 4753. I think there was a note, too. Was there a note? Oh, no. Wait. 9th of July, 1700 hours. What? Oh, we I got some... In a state of agony. It cripples my body, captures my mind, bleeds my soul. Mm-hmm. This thing I've done, this thing, this thing... What is it? It is lunch in the mess hall currently. Oh, the thought of eating repulses me. So I do know my name. My name is Henry Clement. And apparently I did something that is unfathomable. I'm not sure what that is. 
Who, what was that dude's name that we got? Let me check. Codes. Travers. Travers. That's, that's, that sounds like an American name. Travers? Where's Travers? Ah. <laughs> 4753. Uh, the only American. American on this battlefield. 4753. What do you got for me? Grenades? Yeah, that's definitely an American right there. Yep. Let's charge this flashlight to the max. Anything in here? Rations? So with these little... What are, uh, what's this called? Oh, still nothing. A cupboard. Cupboard. With the cupboards, you have to unlatch the thing, then open it. It's a little tedious. Ah, gas grenade. What? My flashlight already died? I thought I cranked it. Where is this monster? This monster is, like, totally not... Like, is the monster even... That did not make the monster angry at all. That was like a loud sound. Where is this thing? <laughs> I don't know where he is. Let me put... I don't really need a gas grenade right now, and I don't need a frag grenade. Honestly, I don't even need the pocket watch right now, so... Yeah, until we find a... Item... Um... Increaser... A bag... That increases your storage limit... Uh, I'm gonna put those things in there. Where is this? This is... Officer Quarters. The arsenal. That's where we need to go to get the dynamite. And... Here is the barrel. I have heard many things about you, Barra. Uh... Not many good ones. There's a hole right there. I probably shouldn't make a lot of noise right next to it. Canteen? Okay. Jobert. Here we go. Here we go. <laughs> Here we go. Here's the monster. Let me close that door. Ah, oh, yes. It even looks kind of blue like Penumbra when you're in the darkness. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's, that's definitely a monster right there. That is monster marks. Mm-hmm. Check the drawers. Another note. 14th July, 1916. Night. Strange scratching sounds a few moments ago, and now it sounds like someone is pacing in the hallway. That's not a person, that's the monster. Probably Reynard, drunk on the stash of wine I know he hides from us. Best I confront him now, either get him into bed to sleep it off, or convince him to share a bottle or two with me. Uh, the next day. Cold fear runs through all of our veins. Fournier, Fournier has terrorized the men for answers. They say they were asleep until Reynard screams. I believe them. Of course. Fournier went, to, went so far as to accuse prisoner 73014 of escaping his cell and committing the murder. Impossible. I worry about Fournier. His rage hides fear. He takes it, it out on the men, and I could see no way to stop it. It breeds contempt. My mind slips back to the moment Reynard started screaming how easily it could have been me. How easily it still could be me. For the first time, I wish the order to attack would come. I would rather face a thousand German guns than this nameless dread. 
That was from Sergeant Stefan Jobert. Jobert. Jo jo Jobert. Uh, yeah, so there's a lot of drama happening in this bunker with all the... All the different ranks and stuff like that. Ah, oh, another note. Oh, gosh. <laughs> I'm just gonna do my American accent. <laughs> to any who find this, Fournier, or commanding officer... Oh, he's a commanding officer. Cowers next to me now. He's lost his mind to an abyss of fear. He repeats the same refrain over and over. Flee, flee, we must flee and seal the beast where it belongs. That was a little bit of French. <laughs> he wants to run, to blow it up, to blow up the exit behind him. Sealing the demon down here. The demon and our men. Okay, well, well we know what option he chose. His constant refrain, it is getting to me and the same void of terror, it is also overtaking me. To any of my men who see this, once we're free of this place, I will get the arsenal code from him. I will get it, and I will radio it back to you. Trapped down here with that beast, the arsenal may be your only hope. It's all I could do, all I have courage to do. Get to the communications room in the soldier quarters, hide there, I'll broadcast the code to you. Okay. So we gotta go to the soldier quarters to get the code in order to go to the arsenal to get the dynamite and to blow open the exit. Uh, that's manageable. How about I turn on that gramophone? Can I crank it? No. But I'm the expert at cranking things. Okay, let's get on out of here. We gotta watch out for booby traps. Like that. What is that? What is that? Someone spilled something? Blanchette, what are you doing in there? Why is that? Okay, let's go in through here. Hello? More notes. Man. <sighs> I, I promise. There's not a lot of notes coming up. Um... Engineers have broken through our storage area and into the old Roman tunnel tunnels. There, as we thought, structurally sound deep, and I confess, I was skeptical of this last point, but they do indeed lead in the direction of the German line. By September, we should be in position to launch a massive push from inside the tunnels. Perhaps of note, inside the tunnels we found urns, Latin texts, etc. We'll do our best to preserve some materials for prosperity. Updates to follow. Interesting. Hmm. They're doing some archaeology in the middle of a war. Ooh, yeah, you can see the Roman ruins. And a s the dynamite, that's probably what we're, <laughs> we're going after. Makes you wonder how much art and, like, just stuff from the past has been lost during war. Just, like, completely destroyed. Ah, oh, yes. I remember hiding in this closet for a very long time. Ah! Fuel. I don't know where this monster is. I really don't know. I have had several close encounters with him playing the demo, so I'm not sure... Oh, there's a lot of notes. Okay. After a raid of last evening, we have in custody some 20 German soldiers from the 4th Reserve Corps of the 2nd Army. This puts our cells past capacity. With one exception, I recommend they be shipped to the camps as soon as feasible. Prisoner 73014, I would like to hold. Before capture, he ripped his rank and insignia from his uniform, so his rank remains unknown. Since capture, he has refused to say a word. I suspect he may be an officer or other important person. I believe one... Once removed from his men, we can break him. Please advise. Oh yeah, that's interesting. I don't know where I heard this, but like... I think in World War II... Like, snipers would target the medic. They would see like the medic logo. And specifically target them because they're... Still nothing in these cabinets? Ah, gosh. I hate this. Oh yeah, 
So this is a pretty hefty box. This is good weight to it. What I'm gonna do... Cover this hole up. Does this work? I don't know. Maybe. Ah, ah, cabinet, cabinet, ah. Okay. Gotta get it really cl I can't move it anymore. Oh. Okay, that's gotta do... That's gotta do for now. So, gotta check for any booby traps. Renard. Re Renard. Doors locked. Fournier. Fournier, are you alive? Fournier. Let's push that in here. Nope. Nope. I hear noises. Let's close that. Nothing in there. I swear, if there's another note in here. Ah! Ah, why so many notes? I bought a game, not a book. Okay. Situation report. After Tremblay's death, the bunker descended into chaos. I've retaken control and ordered the men to form up in squads. They're to hunt the beast down and kill it. They tell me it's not possible. They tell me the bullets don't kill it. They only buy a little time and the beast comes back angrier. Cowards! I've sent them back out now to do as they should, hunt and kill it. If they fail, they'll face a worse fate than claws in the darkness. If you're a commander or a captain, never ever tell your men to do something that you would not do yourself. I don't know where I learned that from. I have ordered increased security for the arsenal, lock and code, and I will root out those responsible for this horrendous act. Justice will be done for France. For France. Yes. Oh, Fournier. Is this your blood, Fournier? What's in here? A machine gun? No? Fournier! Okay, it's crawling in the walls. <laughs> right as I touch that doll. That was kind of creepy. Is this, is this a paranormal game? Fournier liked his doll collection. Another picture. Ooh. A miscellaneous hand. Hopefully that's not Fournier. <laughs> okay, we're starting to hear more of the monster. Which I'm kind of glad because so far it's just been... It's been a little... A little easy. You can see the dust trail. It's traveling above us. Hmm. Let me just cover that hole. Yeah, there's a little hidden. Do, 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 do. Wait. Can I just open this door over here? Uh, delice, delice, delice. I am sorry. For all the French people watching this, I am so sorry if I'm butchering all these names. But also, let me know how my French accent is. I would really like some feedback. <laughs> ah, yes. Let's move this. Try not to make any noise. Ah, come on. Stop rolling around. Oh, I picked up a bottle. Can I drink it? Empty bottle. Dang, I thought I could drink my troubles away. Ah, that was loud. Ah, that was loud again. Ah, oh my gosh. Who is this? Is this Reynard? I love the names in the... Oh. Yeah, Reynard was very troubled. He drew some very creepy... Creepy drawings. Huh. 
Ooh, gas. What is this? A flare? Oh, awesome. You know what? I don't need this bottle. I really don't. How do I drop it? Drop it. No. Oh, man. Do I have to throw it? I just want to drop it. Please. I don't want to throw this. It's going to make a ruckus. I really don't want to throw this. <sighs> I'll throw it at Reynard. Oh, the monster. The monster. Oh! A satchel, which increased my inventory space. I didn't even need to drop that bottle. Ah! <laughs> I swear this isn't my first time playing survival horror. I think that was... I'd like to think that was just artillery. Okay, now I'm getting scared. Now I am getting scared, everybody. Revolver bullets, good. Good. Oh gosh, there was a hole right there. Oh my gosh, okay. Let's let's read this note. To Fournier and Blanchette. I am now putting into writing that I have reported to both of my immediate superiors last evening, 14th of May. I was assigned to the aid the engineers in mapping the Roman tunnels. As I entered the deepest area of the tunnels, I noticed strange glowing liquid seeping from the walls. When I turned around, the walls of the tunnels themselves were suddenly gone and I was standing in a vast plain of darkness. In the distance, there was a sickly light that seemed to be calling me forward. Between it and me, malformed shadows moved. I blinked again. It was gone. It was back in the tunnel. It lasted but a split second, but I am quite convinced that what I saw was no daydream. It was real. Since that experience, I have felt haunted. Haunted. Like a part of me is still there, stuck in the tunnels. I keep seeing shapes moving at the edges of my vision. I am formally requesting medical leave. Please help me. Ah, you're just trying to get out of war. There's no... You, you you can't get out of war. I mean, this dude seemed pretty troubled, though. Yeah, let's get out of here. <laughs> so... Ah, uh, booby trap, you see that? I can't disable it, either. So there was... The dust. The dust. Been in there. I don't want to crank this. Mm, man. Do you see the dust? I think the monster was there. Okay, okay. I want to turn on the generator. I think we deserve a little generator time. Where am I going? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I need some generator time. Ah, ah, ah. Where? Okay, down here. Down here. That was the start of the game. Administration? Okay. Um, yeah. I think... Wait, did I miss... A dog tag. I think there was a dog tag that I missed. Can't remember. But. I will refill this bad boy. Ah, oh, yes. Get it nice and full. The Industrial Revolution has granted me light. And the monster doesn't like light. And the monster's name is actually a swear word. <laughs> I think the the fans in the community kind of uh, named it. I guess it was in a trailer. The name of it's called the Effer. I'm not gonna say the swear word because this is this is a family friendly channel, am I right? But um, yeah, the Effer. I I don't think I'm gonna call him that. 
I think I'll call him like Francois. That sounds better. Francois the monster. Francois, where are you? Let me just check if I missed any dog tags. I might have. I might have. Just gotta do a double take. Any in here? No, no, no. Um, I need to open this door. How I'm gonna do that is probably... Wait, did I open this? Yes, I did. Gas. Does this explode? I'm not sure. But I need to get into Reynard's place. Wait, there was an... Yes, here we go. This was the dog tag. 1518. What did I just pick up? Is that a piece of a heart? Meat. Should not be consumed by soldiers. Better used to attract rodents and other bunker pests. I'm going to keep that because I think we're going to run into some rats. Eventually. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ah, let there be light. Oh, look how lovely that is. Oh, never mind. There's a body down there. Eee. So, let me open... Which door is it? I'm gonna roll this. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. I need to open up a door. Ah, uh, hopefully that's artillery. Uh, probably artillery. Oh yeah. Three in a row. Man, they got some good act. Hmm? I'm making a lot of noise, I just realized that. Where was that bloody door? Ah, yes. Reynard. Oh! Wh wh what is- what is happening? What is that? Why is my vision blurry? I have the light on, I thought... No, 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 no. Where is it? Where's my gun? How many bullets do I have in this? No, no, don't take out bullets. Oh, okay. I got two. It's somewhere. It's somewhere in this hallway. Okay, we're burning light. If I see that dude, I'm just gonna shoot him. I gotta move this. I gotta move it. I gotta open up Reynard's door. Ugh. I hate these dang barrels. They make so much noise. Okay, okay. Francois, you're not gonna like me for this, but I gotta do it. Okay, okay, okay. Let's let's go into this. Uh, let's go in here just for a little bit. Just for just for a little bit. Just for a little bit. Oh. Oh my gosh. This game is scary. <laughs> I think if I try to crank my flashlight in here, it'll get him very angry. Yep, yep, yep. Let's just, let's just put that away. <laughs> so how was your day, everybody? <laughs> I've been looking forward to play this game all day. And it's finally nighttime, which is the perfect time to play a horror game. Or the worst time. I don't know. It's debatable. I think... I think I'm gonna come out now. Jeez, is that... Oh. That's all gas, huh? 
Oh, I accidentally blew up. Oh. Did I shoot a gas barrel or what? Well, I made him angry. Hmm. You've been injured. Be careful. You're now leaving a blood trail that might attract certain creatures. Creatures, plural. What? Leaving a blood trail. Oh my gosh. Oh gosh. It was just a little bit of mustard gas. Okay, I'm gonna open this door and make the monster angry again. <laughs> I'm really making this dude angry. How do I heal myself? This is a really creepy game. I, I was reading the reviews of this and people were saying that this is like the scariest game that they've played. And I kind of understand that because I mean there's a constant threat of being eaten alive. And it's right outside my door. That threat is right outside. <laughs> Francois? Oh, that's a good thing, right? The flare? The flare just... Flare just disappeared. Let's lock that for now. I want to know what this monster looks like. A grenade, okay. Wow, there was only a grenade in here? Okay. Let's see if... Reynard's door is open now. Or whatever it is. Yep. Oh, jeez. That's why there was a bunch of gas, because I blew open... I should have threw a brick at it or something. Gosh. A note from Fournier. Fournier, my favorite, my favorite Frenchman. Further, t further to your investigation of the tunnel sabotage, your assumptions are safe. Start with those who spread the rumors about magic and de devilry in the tunnels. Clearly, they have had sabotage in their minds for weeks. Use any means necessary to elicit confessions. We cannot allow this treason to go unpunished. Alrighty. Whole bunch of wine. Yep, he was hoarding all the wine. Nothing under there. Is the gas good? Gosh. I don't know if it's good or not. Like, I guess I could use it to my advantage. Do I dare shoot that open? Can I shoot that open? I don't know. I don't know if I could shoot that open or not. There's not like a lock. Wait, what did I just pick up? Was it an... What, what did I... Uh, I want you to personally oversee nighttime security in the channels. The last two nights I've heard someone moving through the quarters when there was no patrol scheduled. I will not have another bout of sabotage. If emergency lockdown becomes necessary, find He keeps the necessary lockdown wheels tucked away in mission storage. Dang it, I wasted a bullet. Oh my gosh. I thought you could open that. Man, that was a good bullet, too. Okay. Let me reload. Let me pop it out. What? What? That was my last bullet? Ah, man. Okay. Let me get a grenade out. <laughs> 
I've had enough. I've had enough of this monster. Give me something I could toss. Yep. I'm in business now. No more f no more funny stuff. I'm not gonna end up like that guy. <laughs> hey, who turned Oh, the light is on. Okay, never mind. Haven't been down here yet. Maintenance. Oh yeah, this is... I can't get in through here. Um, let's see, what does this tell me? This is our fourth formal request for a resupply of wine. <laughs> They got their priorities straight. The cellar is running low. I fear the reaction among the men and my fellow officers if we're forced to implement harsher rationing. I'm already fielding complaints on a daily basis. This army runs on morale, and morale runs on wine. My initial request was ten crates. So far, we have received two. Fix it. I mean, just you could just cut down on the alcohol, but okay. Can't carry any more items in your inventory. Well... Gosh, am I gonna throw this? Oh, man. Ooh, a dog tag. Nothing on it. Okay, well, I don't really need this. Monster could have that. I need gasoline. Because that's more useful than a piece of meat. Can't open that. I don't even know what's in there. Wine? Wine. I don't need that. Let's... Let's go back. Over here. Oh gosh, I just have the feeling that it's following me. Over here is... I think the save room. Yeah. Administration, that's the save room. Where's that lamp? Ah, oh, yes. Lovely. Let's go fill up that generator, see how much is left. Yeah, we gotta we gotta preserve that. Let's just turn it off for now. I hate to do that, but you know what? Gotta conserve that precious fuel. Prices are so high nowadays. Uh, okay, oh, our... So mission storage, exit... Okay. Yeah, 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 okay. I think we have some dog tags, so we could go to... The what's it called? The locker? I'm so afraid to run because I feel like if I run, the monster's just gonna get angry at me. <laughs> Should probably unlock this though. Alright, let's see which codes we got. We got. 1518. Where is the. Ah, yes. What was the code? <laughs> 1518. Short term memory is completely shot. 1518. And we get the wheel, which. Hold on. Clement. Wait, that's me. Wait, there's a note for me. 9th of July. I do not know the time, but dusk has fallen and still, of course, no word. When I asked the mm -hmm. sergeant, he shrugged, as if I was asking about when it might next rain. These fools around me, laughing, drinking, arguing. <laughs> do they know what I've done? I don't even know do what you've done. It? I feel they must all be guilty of something. And yet, 
They laugh, drink, argue. Uh, God knows what I've done. I wonder if his judgment could be worse than my own. Okay, what's the date today? Because that was written July 9th. Not sure. Oh, heck no. That thing is like right out there. Oh gosh. No, 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 no. I want grenade. I want grenade. That thing is like... Do you hear it? It's really dark. I'm sorry for that. I don't want to turn on my flashlight because I'm... I'm really scared, but I got... I got to... I just got to... Just got to put the lever in this little thing right here. <laughs> I don't want to make any noise, but I got to turn this thing. Francois, please don't yell at me. Ah! Whoa! Aggressive circles. Okay. This is as far as the demo took me. Where? What? What? Oh, here we go. Soldier quarters and communication. It opened both. Uh, okay. Okay, this is... Hmm. Oh, no. Okay, it was just saving. Uh, we're going into uncharted territory now, everybody. This seems to be freshly excavated. Still holes. Is there a lamp in there? That I could... That thing is angry. No. No, I want to... Open the door. Please. Man. All of this is locked. Oh God, just a dark boy. Oh, no. No, no, no. No. Ah, run! That thing came out of the hole. Nope, nope, nope. It's out there. I was so close. I was this close. What if we go to the soldier quarters? <laughs> Communications is a lost cause right now. Let's go to commu uh, to soldier quarters. Yes. Um. Soldier's quarters. Yes. Much better. Much better. I'm very freaked out, everybody. What? Okay, so it kind of loads the new area, I guess. No. Oh, no, no, no. No, 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 no. Huh? Francois? Francois? <gasps> Francois? 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 Okay, well, Francois is there. Maybe I could go to communications now. Oh, gosh. Francois? <gasps> Fra ah, Francois? No. Oh, my God. No, no, no. No, no, no. No, no, no. Who? What? There's people in these cells? Oh, heck no. Who is in here? German prisoner? Oh, he's got a bag over his head. I don't speak German. I don't even speak French. Oh, I 
got a map? What did I get? I got something. What did I get? I don't, I don't, what am I clicking on? What is that? That's a rat? No, 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 why, where? No, no! Ah! Ah! Oh! Oh! They say that every enemy has a tell. Take the artillery fire, for example. When it gets louder, you know the Germans are coming soon after. Know your enemy well enough, and they will tell you all you need to know. Oh, that's a cool little quote right after my horrible demise. Okay, let's load that last autosave. Eh, I don't, I honestly don't know. I don't know the last time I saved. However, this is going to be the end of part one, everybody. Um, we opened up two new areas. We'll explore them in the next part. Please, 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 please let me know if you enjoy this video. Uh, yeah. That's all for now. Thank you so much for watching, everybody. Goodbye.